Youth runner here with uh, Irvine standout, uh, Summer Wilson. Uh, in case you all forgot, ladies and gentlemen, uh, she continues to be one of the best uh, in the state of California. Validated it again today in the Bill Buechner Girls Championship race at the 45th ASIC School of Cementational, 17088. Uh, obviously, any time uh, that you are in the company uh, of Riley Blade and uh, Sadie Englehart and Hannah Thompson, you're doing something uh, very special. What does this mean to you, Summer? You've got to, had to showcase a lot of patience this fall. Yeah, I mean, it definitely means so much to me just to be able to race like so many talented girls. It's honestly so exciting, like just being out on the course and like be like running with them. It was so much fun, and yeah, it definitely means a lot to me. <laughs> I feel like I feel like during the race. Like, the first mile felt really relaxed, and I think it was like 5.16, so I don't know, that part, that part felt really chill. And then the second mile, I feel like I just kind of like blanked out, to be honest. And I was like, what am I doing? Like, I'm not going hard enough. So, and then that third mile, I was like, okay, now I gotta go, because now it's like the finish. So, <laughs> yeah, just at the end, coming down to the finish, I felt like I had a lot left in me just to like spread it in. And then when I passed Ann Thompson, she's like amazing. Like we were talking, we were sharing a starting box on the line. So yeah, she's just, she's just an amazing runner. And just to be able to have her out there to push me was just so much fun. And yeah, I was, I'm happy with my time, 17.08. I feel like I know I can definitely go sub 17 after this. Cause like, I feel like in that second mile, if I just stay more focused and just like push more, I know I'll have it left in me at the end. So. That just gives me a lot of confidence, and I'm excited to come back um, to the state meet and yeah, run again. Most definitely. How good was it for you to be able to kind of, you know, have a more low key race last week yeah. at Central Park, right? So it was, I mean, I know that you're capable of competing against anyone in the state, but so it wasn't like diving in the deep end right away. It's like, hey, like let's just ease in, into it, you know, let's see yeah. how I feel, and then you know, and then take the big step up because I know you're. You're training at a high level, and your fitness certainly, you know, certainly validates it. But just be like, hey, you know what? Like, like baby steps, you know, to kind of just, you know, get, you know, get the rust out of racing, to yeah. then get you ready for this week. Like, how important do you feel like that was? Yeah, I'm like really happy that I did the Central Park Invitational, just because it was like a really exciting race, and there were there were some really good runners in there, like a Tavin Tribuco Hill. They're an amazing team, and yeah, it was just. It was a great race to have as like an opener. Um, I yeah, I really liked it. I felt like really strong during it, so I feel like like opening up there just like kind of just gave me like a lot of confidence and just like belief in myself. Just like okay, I can run solo and run pretty fast. So like when I have competition, like that's going to be really fun and exciting. Yo, so we're only on October 12th. Obviously, the name of the game is you being back here healthy and happy on November 30th. Uh, but like you talked about, like. You, you know in your mind and in your heart that you're gonna have enough left at the end. Uh, the fact that you were able to respond the way you did today, because like, you know, Maya DeBrower and a couple of those other girls like, you know, like made the move up and then you said like, no, 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 not so fast. Like, I, you know, I, I'm, I'm, once I get to the white ticket booth and the asphalt and, you know, and, and the grass, like that I'm gonna be able to make that push at the end. How reassuring was that for you? Because I know that you're only gonna get better, you know, as, yeah. as we get, you know, closer to the postseason, but to be able to, to respond like that today, how encouraging was that for you? Yeah, it's definitely like really encouraging just to know that like I can like find it in me at the end. And even like during the second mile, like I was kind of planning on it just like like at the end I'm gonna be able to put some put my speed to the test and just like see like what I can do. So I feel like when I race it's nice to always know that like I can like I'll have something in me to just like try to do my best at the end. Awesome. Summer, so glad to have you back. Uh, seeing you representing uh, Irvine at, uh, at such a high level. 17088, we're gonna be talking about uh, Sub-17, uh, right around the corner. Stay healthy, uh, stay motivated, and best of luck going forward. Thank you.